All right, people. Little Ultra Beast training update. Got like 46 days left. It's winding down. Days are actually going by really fast. Only about six weeks left. And this huge challenge will definitely be upon me. Uh, the training's been going pretty good. I mean, anything that I have established in my physical anatomy right now is probably what it's going to be. Probably may be able to put 10% or 15% more, I mean, greatness onto me within these six weeks. But pretty much whatever I have now is what it is. I mean, could cut a little bit more weight, but hey, it is what it is. Got to deal with it. Going to deal with it. It's all about the mind and the heart. My heart's pumping capacity and definitely the ability to keep fluid hydrated within my molecular structure to not be cramping during this long intense journey that i'm about to take uh priming up with good carbs good food so i mean my system is energy efficient and and, and is used to keeping the energy going on long uh the mindset the mindset's still there i just keep thinking about it. actually having dreams about hills <laughs> definitely having dream about hills it's kind of like a, a a sense of success or failure dreams I mean, uh, what could go wrong? I mean, the tire, it's more like, can my exhaustion and my fatigue override my mental ability to want to cross that line? You know, you, you could put everything together. Things just don't go according to plan. I mean, strain my back a little bit a couple days ago. It just goes to show, no matter how perfect your program is, no matter how perfect you think you could uh, write something out or calculate it, a lot of unforeseen things will come up. And that's gonna happen on the mountain. Just when you think you're done, you're not done. Just when you think you've trained enough for a certain obstacle, the obstacle is tougher, they change it up, they put a Mickey in the in the water. I mean, it's just it's it's life. It's 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 being able to go day by day and being having a, enough prepped education within your mind to keep you balanced when you come upon these situations. And this this uh event that I'm about to do is is definitely a display of what we do every day. And the ideal model of how we should try to practice our lives, you know, you don't wake up with too much expectations of anything. I mean, you you take your breath, you appreciate your interactions, and you appreciate all the circumstances that come your way. May it be great or difficult, because there's always a reason. Just like when you come through these obstacles, they're to test different strengths and weaknesses in you. I mean, if they're to test your weaknesses, I mean, it shows you what you need to get strong on, and it's on you to sacrifice on the inside, humble yourself, and deal with your weaknesses, and push on, because if you don't, you'll stay there, and if I don't, I'll stay there, and I will not move on. You will not be able to pass on to the next obstacle, so in life, passing days, passing events, I mean, you got to be able to see things for what they are, conquer them, absorb the positive information out of it, whatever the situation may be, and, and, and move on with stride, and... I definitely feel that on April 30th, everything that I live, say, and try to display and things I've experienced and things I've gone through past, present, it's coming down into one big nutshell. And, and, and this is going to be the time where let's see what you're about. Let's see what you got. Let's see why Darren Kane does what he does, why he trains what he does, why he tries to inspire his clients and why he tries to implement a positive aura the people with the people that he comes in contact to help shift them in the direction that they need to go in their individual lives never tell anybody where to go and never tell anybody what to do and never do i judge but i do within my power try to create that atmosphere that helps people get through those blockades in their head that is limiting them from being great and as i try to inspire I will be tested with that inspirational stuff that I push out. So this this would be really interesting, man, because this got me, you know, up late at night in my dreams thinking about this event. So this would be great. So with anything, be kind, be grateful. Have a beautiful day, people.